um, in the first half of that tour, we were flying around the country. We could be called anywhere in the country um, within a moment's notice. And it would generally take half a day in a Black Hawk or a Chinook. But as soon as this aircraft uh, arrived in Kabul, version followed the, had the initial ones on test in September 2000, began training on the site in August 2006, declared operational in January 2007. So this is now a very mature machine indeed to make a rolling vertical landing and we can now see that indeed those engine nacelles have transitioned. Yes, and when, uh, when compared to a conventional helicopter, um, the rotor nest on a conventional helicopter generally moves no more than about 10 degrees. Um, so 10 degrees of its thrust is moving the aircraft forward, whereas this moves up to 90 degrees, therefore when it is in wingborne flight, 100% of that thrust is moving the aircraft forward, hence uh, it's capable of moving the flight.